I'm trying to go celebrate, so. Yeah. <laughs> hey, how much do you love when the opposing team comes out and says you can't run against them? Uh, I don't want to say I love it, you know what I'm saying? Because this is an every week thing. Uh, you know, the, the titles in the media, they get, you know, you know, they get put a certain way. And then another team, you know, it's happened three weeks in a row. Another player, you know, they feel like um, they're being targeted, you know, so they want to say something and, you know, smack talk gets talked here and there. But really, uh, like I said before, dude, I'm proud and happy of this offense. We can go against anybody. And I'm just speaking facts. So. Uh, how nice was it when you came out to the curtain call? I call it curtain call to, to the uh, students. You know, when you was, when they you were surrounded, part of that right there together. Oh, it, it was amazing. The atmosphere was amazing. You know, that's this. This is what football is all about. That's college football right there. You know that I'm living my dream right now, um, and I couldn't be more happier. The support and the crowd was amazing. So it was the best feeling ever, for real. That's great. You played the high school before yet. Um, it was at the same time. I can't really. I didn't really <laughs> was this the best crowd that you played for since you've been? Oh, um, I would say so. Uh, I remember my freshman year was my my. Um, I remember South Carolina at home. It, that that was, it was crazy. It was crazy here, and it was nuts. But I think that this one might have topped it. This might be one of the best ones. Yeah. Benny, do you think you should be a Heisman candidate? Uh, I'm gonna let that just be in the air. Uh, it is what it is. Um, my play speaks for itself. That's all I have to say. Benny, Coach Duke said that teams have to learn how to win. You guys have been through some heartache over your time here. Have you guys learned how to win in these kind of games? Yes, sir. I, I can definitely say that. We, we learn how to win. Um, this team's very good at knowing when we're beating ourselves. You know, we, we're good at making those halftime adjustments. We go inside. It's like, look, guys, we, we know we're beating ourselves. We know that. We, the penalties were, were kill, the penalties are killing us. When we got those one-on-one -on -one matchups, we got to win. And, you know, we get, we're getting moving when we're running the ball, so it, it's really all on us, you know. And I don't want to say we're a second-half team because I don't, I don't like that. I like when we come out with that fire. But we're, we're great when it's the second half and finishing those games. But this team got that finish. This team got that fight. And, and, and that's what I'm proud of my guys for that. What do you say on a night when we honor Sonny Collins that you pull out this mm -hmm. and smack state of the mouth? Oh, um, it's great. You know, it's great. Um, Sonny Collins, he's, he's a great guy. And he, he was a great runner, too. Oh, my gosh. I love watching this film. Um, it was great to meet him at practice and for him to be an honorary captain, for him to be <clears> out there, amazing, you know. Um, I'm always, I always want to learn and be around greats. You know, I always want to learn. I'm always a sponge, so. It was amazing. Did he give you any words of wisdom when you all met the other day at practice? Uh, he told me. He told me. I, I want you to. I want you to get that record. He told me he wants me to get that record and how great of a runner I was. And you know, I was just humble. I was humble. So. I know this will marinate over time, but right now in in the present, uh, how does it feel to break Randall Cobb's record for most career touchdowns at Kentucky? Uh, it, it was a long time coming. Um, I'm very blessed. Uh, I want to just give a, a, a side note with that. My old line, my tight ends, I'm nothing without them. Especially with the receivers blocking on the outside. They, they do such a great job getting movement and getting me to the end zone. So without them, I'm nothing. So, But I'm very happy. I'm very happy I got the record. And that's just one down. We got more to go. Benny, what does it mean to out-physical a physical team? Uh, it means that we run it down their throat over and over and over and over and over again until they're tired and they can't take it. Uh, that's that's one thing this this offense is good at. We're able to keep we're able to keep running. We're able to just keep pounding. You know, we'll we'll catch you off sides with a, with a pass or a trick play. But we know that we can get movement and you know just getting those three four yards. And then in, in the third and fourth quarter, you know I'm under the pile. I can hear us. Uh, uh, I can hear the D line. The, the, the linebackers are tired. The safeties aren't running up as hard. You know, so. That's when, that's when you know, it's money time. <laughs> so we, and we got them, you know, we got them to tie. Benny, what was said in that little altercation in warm-ups when you guys kind of met as if Bill was so Oh, uh, <laughs> it was, I could say it was the linebacker, the linebackers, of course, the big uh, D line, number 94. You know, they're like, they're like, yeah, I want you. I want you. I'm like, oh yeah, I want you. I want you. <laughs> you, know, you know, just, 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 just hype talk. Um, you know they, they they came they came at the uh, 
it was at the 50, and you know, we're at home. So, you know, I told all my guys, we took that as disrespect. That's disrespectful for them to come, come in our home and do that. I told the guys, and they're like, all right, we're going to handle it. Okay. Bet, let's do it. Vinny, last week when we asked you about Mississippi State, you got, a little, you got a little angry look in your eyes for a brief moment. You look like you're running mad tonight. Did last year's game feed into this at all? Not at all. I, every every year is a new year. Every game is a new game. We take it we take it game by game each each uh you know each week. We knew this was a great opponent, and in practice we we prepared for him as hard as we could. And you know guys got that extra work. Guys wanted that grit. Guys wanted to come in and get better. So you know it's a team effort. Yeah. Benny, did Kylan Hill say anything to you after the game? We did. Uh, I wouldn't talk to an offensive player even. You know. Uh -uh. Vinny, you've got the uh, Marco Shimwell thing on your arm. Can you talk about that and what that meant for you tonight? Yeah. Um, I, I put RIP Marco. You know, I wrote it on my wrist. It's it's what I it's it's heartbreaking when you really look when you really just look at life and how short it is. It's just it's just heartbreaking. Um, we play this team. We we play for him. We play for that family. For you know his life to be so short. You know him him just wanting to. You know, see a football game for the first time and enjoy life. And just thinking about it, it just makes me so sad. But it definitely gave um, it gave that extra push, that extra heart up under us that, you know, we got to do this for him. We got to do this for Schlarman. We got to do this for JP because they're not able, they're going, they're going through something right now. They're, they're fighting a tough time right now. So, you know, we always, we always got motivation on this team. We always got chips on our shoulders that make us want to go harder. So that's what I have to say. I mean, I think how proud are you of this first team? Time since 1977, I think you guys were two and zero in the SEC. Yeah, I know you guys take it all one game at a time and whatnot. But how pivotal of a moment is this? For you? Uh, it's very big. Um, it's really a long time coming. Uh, like I always say, this team's different. This team's different this year. Um, guys, all around, man. Like it's just crazy. To, I'm so proud of my linemen. You know, it's. It's just guys. It's just a lot of talk, you know. A lot of talk, a lot of talk, in the media and the media. You know, we come in to play football. We always in the locker room talking about alignment. We well, guys, we here to play football. This is what we do, you know. So when we go out between the white lines, it's, it's game time, you know. So that's what I can say. A couple more for Benny. So we his family. Benny, what's it been like to see the growth in the physicality in this program? How much better you guys are in both lines of scrimmages, and just how much that has grown over the last couple. Of years? Um, it's it's amazing. It's amazing, really, what I can say. The defense. I'm very, very happy with the defense. They did some amazing things, all across the board. Josh Allen. Oh my gosh, doing doing some great things, getting to the quarterback. Cash Daniels, Cash Money, Jordan Jones, them swarming to the ball. Um, my boy Ty, Ty, Tyrell to get that pick. You know, they're just, they're just doing great things. You know, from last year um, and for the years that I've been here, I can say this team's different. And I can say that this team's a lot closer. Guys are coming in for extra film. Lyman got questions, I got questions. I'm gonna call them up. We FaceTime each other about the test. We get we get tests before the game. You know, I got a question about this, this, and that. Josh, Josh Allen, he asked me, Dre Jones, you know, they asked me questions. Yeah, what do I do if you're running back, this, this? And I'll give him my opinion. And then he'll he gets better from that. Then I'll add, then I then I got questions myself. So we just always get better. The young guys, the young guys of this team, they're all sold in on the mission that we want to uh, accomplish, which is, you know, we want to be a better team and we're a different team. So the young guys are sold. Everybody on the team is sold on all four of the special teams, on defense and on offense. So Last that's, that's what I'm happy with, with this team. we got a bunch of players in that waiting over in the lobby, too, for you all. Anybody else? Did Randall talk to you at all this week about his record, or did you talk to him at all about it? I didn't. I, I tweeted that he said to go get it. He go get that record. Um, <laughs> I seen that. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. I'm like, random. I got you, baby. I'm, I'm going to do it. So, yeah. All right. Thanks, buddy. Yeah.